Well, another autumn ride. It's cool. It's raining. Not raining too hard, so. It's a triumph of the will. Overcoming the desire to sit around and play on the iPad. I'll feel better for it afterwards. Almost by definition, autumn weather is hit and miss. And yet you still gotta you still gotta make the effort. Because you know that even worse is to come in the winter. But it's one of the problems, I think, when you get older, it's easier to draw on the excuses why it's difficult to get out because you're not really chasing fitness goals as you were when you were younger, increasing average speeds and such like. You're kind of going out to maintain fitness and take a little positive hit to your well-being today's one of those days just gotta get out so autumn attire well multiple layers is the thing Two layers plus a soft shell. And really important this time of year. In fact, almost any time of year, wearing gloves. Long finger gloves today. Yeah, you don't want to go down. Bare hands. On a Saturday morning, we go riding in groups from 7 a.m. Now, normally that's fantastic because you're back before the traffic builds up, you've got the whole day ahead of you. But this time of the year, it's 7 a.m., it's dark, and it's not fun riding in the dark. I occasionally suggest to the others in the club. And on Saturdays in the winter, autumn and winter, we should start out later, right in the light. It's easy for me to say that because I'm retired now and I can ride any time. So most people are still working and have got a bit of family responsibility, so they kind of got their routine. They want to get out, get back, and get on with the day. So you can't blame them really. But it's kind of a shame really, in some, some in one respect, because new people aren't going to join the club in the autumn and the winter. They're going to perceive it as too dangerous to ride so early in the morning and in the dark. So you end up with the winter months being the core riders only. And then you're going to kind of try and rebuild community interest again in the spring. But hey, oh, I have my say, but I'm only one of many, and that's fine. The other thing that's essential in the autumn, the lights. Now, I've always had lights on my bike. Didn't help me last year when I got knocked off though, but got to play the percentages and so occasionally we'll have people come out with us the angle working lights and they're taking the the lives in in their hands one of the remarkable things about
about cycling is that unless the weather's really bad, no matter how reluctant you are to get started, once you're out into the, into the nature, you can feel the wind, feel those muscles burning. It always seems worthwhile. This is great this morning, despite the wet. I was complaining about the rain before, but this is the real deal. <laughs> every order right when you think I'm putting off more than I can chew. I'm soaking, my feet are freezing. <laughs> 